So here's another daily tip from your friendly local dermatologist. All right, let's talk about loofahs. Let's talk about washcloths. And let's talk about all the other things that people tend to use in the shower to put their cleansers on their body. Notice I didn't say soap, because soaps are too harsh, but cleansers on the body. Now, I am not a fan of any of these things for the vast majority of people. So let's just think about that washcloth. Let's say you change it out once a week or maybe twice a week. So you're scrubbing it on your body, right? And it's collecting all your body oils, because that's what you're trying to wash off, and all your skin cells. And then you just lay it there for it to dry. So it's in a humid, moist environment with lots of oils, lots of dead skin cells, and it's a Petri dish for bacteria. And then the next day you come back and you shower and you're grinding that Petri dish of bacteria into your skin. It's not a good idea. But let's say you say, okay, Reagan, I'm gonna change out my washcloth every day. And then what you're doing is you're basically taking a mild form of sandpaper and you're scratching your skin off. Guys, you don't need that. Please be gentle with your skin. And the same thing goes for loofahs. You know, these have been around for forever and I have personally never seen anybody's skin get better from using a loofah. You know, they have them on that long stick and people are sitting there scratching their backs off, you know, trying to dig for gold. And then they come in with these big marks of dry, irritable skin. It's not good for you. For the vast majority of people, save your money, save your time. Use these guys, put on the cleanser, let it sit for 30 seconds. Let it do what it's supposed to do. Rinse it off, pat dry, then apply your good lotions and go about your day.